Dear colleagues, in this video I want to show my lens tilt technique for soft cataract phaco emulsification. The main incision has been placed at a selected site. Viscoelastic substance has been injected in the anterior chamber. Now visco is sprayed over the corneal epithelium for better visualization. Now one side port is being made about three clock hours away from the main incision on the left side. And now 26 case bent needle is taken, the anti-capsule is incised and the flap is raised. And now I take a uterta forceps, hold this capsule tag, go anti-clockwise and do a continuous curvilinear capsular axis. For lens tilt technique, the axis has to be about 6 millimeter, not 5 millimeter, should be about 6 millimeter, that is on the larger side, so that the nucleus can prolapse, on equator of the nucleus can prolapse, here it is. By hydrodissection, one equator has prolapsed out of the capsular bag. Now I inject visco on either side of this prolapsed nucleus, prolapsed equator and now is the time to introduce the tip of the phaco handpiece. The bevel of the phaco tip faces the nuclear mass. The topper supports the nucleus from the other side. Fico power being used is about 30 percent and now I make some cuts and as I make these cuts this portion of the nucleus has come off and it has been removed. Now this is the remaining portion of the nucleus, about two-third of the nucleus is there and the, this portion tumbles and there is some, you know, it sticks to the aspirating port of the phaco tip. it is emulsified and taken out. So the nucleus has been managed very easily and now some cortical lens matter is there. This has to be removed. I'm using a Simco cannula 23 gauze. You can use a coaxial IA since there is only one side port. Bimanual cannot be used in this case. And now the cortex from the right side is being removed. This is the cortex at 9 o'clock and a sub incisional cortex is remaining and let us see if it will come. Yes, the sub incisional cortex has come off. Now there are a lot of cells sticking to the posterior capsule. <coughs> so what I do is I do hydro polish. I use the irrigating jet of fluid to dislodge these cells and do nice polishing of the posterior capsule and see how beautifully you can polish the posterior capsule. Here it is. See how beautiful it looks. And now an intraocular lens is being implanted, keeping the antechamber formed by irrigating fluid. Both the haptics have gone into the capsular bag and now little bit of moxifloxacin is injected into the antechamber. The side ports are hydrated the stroma on either side of this stab incision is hydrated and a final lavage of 
the entry chamber is done and that's it thank you very much for your attention hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills you have watched how lens tilt technique is so nicely employed in soft cataract phaco emulsification